What's up guys, welcome to your fifth tutorial in Flash. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to add a motion guide to your animation. Now what a motion guide is, it allows you to move your object or animation along any path that isn't straight. So let's get started in learning how to do this. Select your first frame and make sure it's a keyframe. And draw any object that or image that you want. I'm going to just because I feel like working with a basketball today. I'm going to draw sweet basketball into my first keyframe. And since we're going to be working with a motion guide, we're going to be need to convert it to a symbol. So to do that, highlight your first keyframe right here and click modify convert to symbol, then click okay. Now your animation instead of a basic shape it has become a symbol so now to go to another frame and insert a keyframe now move your object around the canvas click in between it and click tween motion as you can see we now have an arrow with a purple faded background and this lets us know that our motion has worked. Remember it needs to be a symbol to convert it to a motion. Now simply, simply press enter and you can see that we now have a motion guide along our image. So now that we have a basic straight from point A to point B, let's learn how to create a motion guide. To do this, highlight your first keyframe. Make sure your first keyframe and layer one is highlighted. Then click this little button that looks like a curve with dots on it. And it says add motion guide and click add motion guide. Now you see that you have a new layer that pops up. Now in your new layer, not, not the one that says layer one, but the one that says guide layer, highlight your first keyframe. And with your pencil tool, I'm going to do that. Now this is your path that it's going to follow. And it's not actually going to appear on the screen. It's just a guide. Now go back to your layer 1 and highlight the first keyframe. As you see the beginning of the path. Now go to your last keyframe in layer 1. And as you can see the path. So now we have layer number 1 keyframe in layer number one make sure you're not in your guide layer and keyframe in layer number two now as you see we now have a path and when we press enter our object now follows that guide layer so remember you make your guide in your guide layer and you snap it in on layer number one so let's see how this looks like if we're actually tested. As you can see, when it actually shows, our guide layer doesn't show and our basketball appears to be bouncing along whatever path we made. And this is how you can make a motion layer to move your objects along any line that isn't straight. And next time we're going to be talking more about animation, but if you missed anything that I went over today, you can go to my website, thenewboston.com, and I'll have a step-by-step -step instruction, instruction on how to do all of this. Thank you.